The industry this year has seen a lot of surprises as far as commercial success of film is concerned. It has been seven months into 2018, and we have already seen more than 10 hit films and the count is just expected to escalate further in the coming few months. While some anticipated films like Gold, No Masti England, Thugs of Hindustan, Student of the Year 2, Kadarnath 2.0, Total Demal, Zero and Simba are expected to set the cash registers ringing, there are several small-budget content-driven films that can spring in a pleasant surprise. This week we'll see the release of two such films, Fanny Khan starring Anil Kapoor, Ashwarya Rai, Rajkumar Rao and Karwan starring Irfan Khan, Dulkweer Selman, Mathila Palkar. While Fanny Khan follows the template of feel-good cinema and attempts to make the audience believe that IT is okay to dream big, Karwan on the other hand is a film about self-discovery on a road trip. The trailer of both the films have found appreciation from a limited section of audience. An added benefit for the two films is the fact that they are riding on an acclaimed star cast, who can get the audience in Cinema Hall if backed by the right content. Being small films, it isn't a clash as such because there are enough screens, shows and audience for both the films, and what is essential here is the word-of-mouth publicity. After a fair start, if the two films command a positive word-of-mouth from their respective target audience, the biz would escalate over the weekend and the films would pose a respectable total in the long run. Over the years a lot of films have taken a slow start at the ticket window but ended up being profitable ventures by the end of their lifetime run due to the positive audience feedback, Fanny Khan and Car One would belong to the same category of films. Unlike the star-driven films which are front-loaded in terms of business, the content here is going to be the real star that would get the audience in the cinema hall over the weekend. Here's looking forward to see how the audience and critics receive these two slice-of-life feel-good films. The relatively small content-driven successful films in last few years are Talvar, 28.20 crore rupees NH10, 32.10 crore rupees Pika, 79.92 crore rupees Pink, 68 crore rupees Happy Bob J. Yegi, 28.82 crore rupees Nirja, 75.61 crore rupees Tamhari Sulu, 34.25 crore rupees The Ghazi Attack, 20.50 crore rupees Nam Shabana, 36.50 crore rupees Newton, 22.18 crore rupees Bear Ali Ki Barfi, 34 crore rupees Shub Mangal Sivadan, 41.90 crore rupees Fakri Returns, 80.13 crore rupees Parmanu, 65.69 crore rupees Rousey, 123.84 crore rupees 102 Not Out, 52.45 crore rupees Hichki, 46.21 crore rupees